Alrighty, bearing in mind again, this is for last week, but that is fine. Welcome to this week's Beardsy's Game Board Goss with all of your weekly gaming news. Uh, in news today, me and Beards are uh, pregnant. Yes, Manny and I, that is actually, I was going to get to that at the end, Manny. That was the big surprise, does that mean you were pregnant together, Manny? But now you've ruined it by me having to say it first. But yes, Manny and I are pregnant, everyone. It's very, very exciting. Um, it's going to be called, uh, it, it, it's, uh, Game of Metal, um, is going to be the, uh, the scorn is, oh my god, b bombshells dropping, bombshells dropping, <sighs> god, metal of beards, that's metal of man, <laughs> in other news, I've also moved in with a gorilla, yes, 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 but no, uh, there's actually quite a, a, a few, uh, a, a, quite a, a little, a bit to get through in, uh, Game Board Goss. Uh, and it actually has nothing really to do with the fact that it's slightly late. Um, but those who are subbed, uh, and those who have spent 5,000 bits on my channel, you may have already realised that my first piece of Game Board Goss is actually for you. Okay? Yeah, there we go, there we go, there, here we go. We have some new emotes, guys. We, we have some new emotes, which is really exciting. So the first one... Uh, is one of our uh, our personal favourites. Uh, it is the they don't call me rank one for nothing uh, emote. Uh, exactly five pixels. Exactly, it's delicious, especially when it's blown up like this. It looks fucking delicious. Um, so, so this one is if you are subbed. This is a sub emote. Um, which is really 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 cool. I I have no doubt that I'm going to get bagged the shit of out of, uh, using, using this, uh, lovely emote. Uh, and the other one, uh, and, and Casket, if you're still in chat, it, it, <laughs> Scorn! Scorn, what is a, th what is this thousand bits nonsense? Are that <laughs> God, thank you for the thousand bits, my friend. I really appreciate that. That's insanely kind of you. I do appreciate it. But Scorn has demonstrated when you have uh, spent 5,000 bits uh, on my stream, uh, you get access to this this wonderful uh, second emote. Uh, and, and that, of course, is uh, the toxic emote. The toxic emote. Um, <laughs> Scorn absolutely scored like, fucking, I need, I fucking need it. Um, which I think this is also going to be one that is used quite a lot, especially when we're playing DBD and Faz and people are um, making, you know, me do shit to other people and whatnot. This is going to be a great one. Um, now, Blaze and Toast has already said what I was about to say. We do have more coming. This is just two out of, uh, seven, seven new emotes coming your way. Um, uh, because we can have follower emotes now as well. Um, so there are seven new emotes coming your way. This is two. So there are still five, five on their way, which is really, really exciting. So hopefully we have those soon so we can show them to you. Those are actually, uh, Blaze and Toast did these two emotes, uh, emotes, emotes. Uh, so you can thank Blaze and Toast for these two, um, emotes. And uh, I am getting the other ones done by by the same uh, wonderful guy who di has done all of my um, writing logo uh, emotes so far and stuff. So these new heart train emotes are a bit weird. <laughs> Acorn emote when that'll be the eighth new one. Uh, scorned. Uh, so that, that as I said, there are, there are more coming. So stay tuned. Hopefully we will have them um, soon. So that that is really really exciting. Okay. When I get yeah exactly when I get to partner I can have I can have no I I've I've maxed out the subs for slots now I I I have to um I, I have to get partner I think is the next step unfortunately a mushroom emote is completely off the table Dougie <laughs> uh, but there is a surprise emote coming Dougie that be, bearing in mind there there is a, an emote in there which I'm not happy about all right just just a little clue for the, for for one of them okay. Alrighty, so, Macca, how are you doing, my friend? I, I promise I will not ban you from my own stream, Macca. I promise. You, you're safe here. Unless um, Manny decides he wants to fake ban. 
<laughs> Thank you for the shout out, Manny. Guys, if you haven't checked out Macca, uh, Macca is a relatively new streamer to DBD, the wonderful world of DBD in the fog. Uh, a lovely, lovely, lovely human being. So please give them all of the support. Click that link there. Um, glad to hear I'm safe. <laughs> I mean, you're never safe around me, let's be honest. I'm, I... Oh, you already told everyone in Discord the surprise. Okay, there's a mothy emote coming, everyone. There is, there is a mothy emote coming, I repeat. Um, uh, well, that's true, but it doesn't matter, Blazing Toes. I can't be fucking changing it. Uh, there, yes, <laughs> there is a mothy emote coming, which I am disgusted about, but I'm sure you're all wrapped about. Could bring out the hammer exactly. I, I mean, I don't do a lot of hammering in my own stream. Uh, I've got a lot of people that hammer for me. Could sound weird, I suppose, if you say that out loud, but anyway. Um, so yes, that is all of the Game Boy Goss in relation to uh, emotes. So, moving right along, again, this is from last week, so this is slightly dated uh, now. But, last week... TV, how are you going, you legend? So good to see you, my friend. Um, <laughs> can you f fucking clip some good jump scares? Oh, yes, yes, guys, that is the other bit that I haven't put on Game Boy Goss. Um... I think I said it last stream. Uh, Manny is working on my Dead Space trailer, and I, I've only seen 20 seconds of it, and he's fucking... It had me in stitches. You're all going to love it. But we need more scares, and we need more clips. So if you donate, and you get a good scare, even if it's just me squealing, please, please, please clip it so uh, Manny has more clips to work with. I would really appreciate it. Manny would really appreciate it. What the fuck is wrong with your hat tonight? Oh, it's because it's Star Wars. It's like, there's a lot of um, yellow on the bottom. Yeah, it's actually yellow. It just doesn't like yellow either. <laughs> but it's uh, just reinstalled Windows Fresh. <laughs> Fair enough, TV. I'm glad to hear you're going well, though. Play, uh, time to play Dead Space 2 and 3. We might get there. Sarah, how are you going? How are you going, your legend? Yellowy green, exactly. Um, so last week, there was the Pokemon Presents... Uh, which got a lot of people excited. There were some really, really cool things coming out of that last week. Uh, the first one, obviously, being Pokemon Legends Arceus. We actually got some gameplay, um, or sort of gameplay, out of uh, Pokemon um, Legends Arceus. Not Arceus. Arce Arceus. <sighs> Legends of Arceus. Uh, <laughs> Battle Eye anti-cheat doesn't blue screen my computer anymore. Well, that's good. Um, I remember you were complaining about that on your stream when I was lurking in your stream. I remember you saying it was uh, fucking up your, your game. Ars, Arsir, Arsaurus? <laughs> uh, but anyway, Arceus. Uh, so I, I I watched all of these clips that came out of the um, out of the Pokemon Presents. Um, but he's looking so cool. Like, so, so cool. Ars e us. Ars e us. <laughs> there you go. That's all of those redemptions done in one there. Um, but if you haven't checked out Anus... Let's just shorten it to anus, shall we? Controversy. Asking this. Arceus. Arceus. <laughs> Ars. I'm an anus. Oh my god. Dude. <laughs> yeah, I think so, Panda. <laughs> but if you haven't checked out anus, uh, please check out anus gameplay. Okay? Anus gameplay. It, it looks like it's going to be a fucking ripper of an anus. Okay? A fucking ripper of an anus. So please check out uh, the trailer, if you haven't already. It looks like it's going to be really, really cool. Uh, and the second asses are us. <laughs> uh, and... <laughs> uh, and the, the other one, obviously, that came out of the same uh, Pokemon Presents was uh, the Pokemon Diamond... Uh, uh, sorry, Brilliant Diamond Shining Pearl gameplay. Now, I was really scared that they were going to cut parts out of this game uh, that were in the original, but I am so happy that they have decided to keep the underground and the hidden bases and everything that made Diamond and Pearl amazing. Uh, they've kept it, which I'm, I'm stoked about. I'm so super, super stoked about. Are we, quote, 113? Excuse me? That's disgusting. Um, <laughs> anyway, uh, so yeah, I'm really excited. I'll, I'll cut parts out of you. Anyway, uh, <laughs> uh, I, I'm really excited that they have. Uh, it looks like they have kept really true to the originals with this one, which is which is really cool. Um, so again, we got to see a bit of gameplay out of um, Diamond and Pearl and um, Arses R Us. So, uh, and the final thing that came out of uh, Pokemon Presents, uh, guys, if you haven't seen it already, um, I can see a. Ch 
Um, was the limited edition Switch Lite. So if you are somebody who is into uh, the limited edition consoles and you are a Pokemon fan, <laughs> ban me. Ban me. Uh, look how wholesome the first one is compared to the last one. Wait, what? <laughs> um, if you're a fan of limited edition consoles and you love Pokemon, have a look at this beauty. I love the steel grey and I love the simplistic design of it. I think, I think it's really cool. I'm not going to get it, but... I think people that like the limited edition consoles should get it because it, it looks great. Uh, if you're somebody that doesn't like playing Switch on your TV, this is the console. <laughs> yeah, exactly. If you are somebody who only plays their Switch essentially on the train or not in the car, because unless you're in the passenger seat. Um, <laughs> but, um, but yeah, true. I, I actually rarely play my Switch on the TV. I'm not going to lie. And I have a normal Switch. I've actually got... Oh, hang on. I've got it right here. I've actually got um, the... Uh, the the freaking oh you can't look it goes invisible Ooh, i've got the limited edition invisible switch uh which cost me an arm and a leg but um you know uh, uh like i asked i asked the people to show me what it looked like and they got it out of the box and i couldn't see anything i said sold done absolutely sold i can see finger marks on your back and that's gross manny anyway uh show it again why what what a Limited edition invisible switch. Okay. Uh, so anyway, back on track. Because we get off track so so often here. Anyway, limited edition uh, diamond and pearl switch light. Okay. Invisible switch. It, it is one of... It's the fourth Deathly Hallow, actually, Dougie. Uh, the fourth one. Uh, it's not mentioned in the books, but it does exist. Alrighty. Now, uh, on to the next bit of Game Board Goss. This is something that everyone asked for. Everybody wanted... And here we go. This is the first reiteration of this game you have ever seen. It is Skyrim, the 10th version. I mean, 10th anniversary version. you got to love it. There is a Skyrim 10th anniversary edition uh, coming out. This is something everyone asked for. Exactly. Um, they have announced it has been 10 years since Skyrim was released. 10 Fucking year. How insane, right? Now, uh, let me tell you what this 10th anniversary edition has. Exactly, Pyro. I will get to that, my friend. Um, wait. Okay, let me tell you what it has. It has uh, the full game along with its three DLC, so Dawnguard, Hearthfire, and Dragonborn. Um, but it's got new features, like Pyro said, such as a fishing mechanic. You can now go fishing in Skyrim, okay? Um, <laughs> I, I do have a way with words, right? Uh, you can now go fishing in Skyrim. It is everything you could have ever asked for. Um, as well as 500 pieces of Creation Club content, such as quests, dungeons, bosses, weapons, and spells unique to this version. Uh, but no further details yet on what those specific things are, okay? Uh, does it have any fuss road dart? No, no, it doesn't have fuss road dart. They've deleted that. Um, uh, uh, they've only got Pokemon in this one, I believe. Um, but guess what? It's not coming to Switch. It's not coming to Switch. It is coming to PC, Xbox, PlayStation, um, and not Switch. So if you've got a Switch and that is it, too bad. Um, now, a lot of people obviously have a, a bit of backlash about how many versions of Skyrim have come out. Uh, but uh, the uh, Bethesda game director, uh, Todd Howard, said, if you want us to stop releasing it, stop buying it. Mic drop. Mic drop? <laughs> like, they have millions of people who still play this game every single month, despite it being out for 10 years. And that is his... I think that is the most perfect response. If you want us to stop releasing it, stop buying it okay so if you want to boycott skyrim don't buy this okay but if you love skyrim buy it okay now this is uh scheduled to release on november 11th so it's actually not that far away guys not that far away so skyrim 10th anniversary edition coming to a retailer slash digital near you that doesn't really make sense so let's move on uh, what the function? I'll get it for Xbox. Yeah, you'll have to get it for Xbox. Uh, you cannot get it on Switch, at least at, at, at this point in time, anyway. 
Um, the original day of the re- yes, it is. Yes, Pyro, that is correct. Yeah, so it's literally exactly 10 years. Yeah, that's when it's being released. Yeah, you, you are correct, Pyro. Um, it was like the Monster Hunter crew who made a mobile version, then they got booed. They said, what, what, don't you have phones? <laughs> exactly, exactly. Okay, now, if, if running around a, 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 a world with swords and shields and magic spells isn't for you, and you like to pick up a gun instead and shoot people, this might be the news for you. The next COD has finally got a release date, okay? So this is Call of Duty Vanguard, which is the next COD in the series. Uh, this one is actually set out in uh, World War II. World War II. So we're going not going into the futuristic ones, we're going back into the past ones again, okay, guys? Um, that was a lot of stuttering. Today, Junior. Uh, yeah, so this could be a recycled COD game. Uh, we're not... I mean, probably is. It's COD. Uh, but anyway, uh, <laughs> Call of Duty Vanguard uh, is, is slated to release on November 5th. November 5th. Okay. Um, controversy, who knows? Who knows? Maybe you can. Maybe you can and, and rewrite history. Maybe. Yeah. Who, who knows? But uh, yeah, that's all I've really got for this. Call of Duty Vanguard is coming out November 5th. Okay, that is that is all I've got for that. Um, again, if, if shooting people isn't your thing, if shooting people isn't your thing, uh, I know a few people in chat ha- are, are, are a big fan of this series, okay? Uh, and that is Life is Strange. Uh, they released uh, a first gameplay trailer for True Colors, which is the next Life is Strange in this series. So again, if you are a fan, check out the video. I have not actually checked out the video yet, but, um... Uh, I have something to say that I feel you'll appreciate. Oh, God. Uh, looks like certain streamers have early access to Psychonauts 2. Ah, there you go. I mean, probably. Uh, remember in Sniper Elite, you could shoot Hitler in the balls? Yeah. <laughs> I mean, Sniper Elite, you could do a lot of weird things controversy, to be fair. <laughs> um, Life is Strange 2. I actually haven't played any of the Life is, Life is Strangers, uh, Panda, believe it or not. Uh, you didn't clean last night's dishes. Huh? Yes, I did. I cleaned the entire kitchen. I cleaned the entire kitchen. This isn't part of game board goss. The goss is that I did. Everything in there tonight is is today's dishes. Thank you very much. Anyway, so if you like Life is Strange, you want to see gameplay, they have released a first trailer for it, okay? That is that is this. <laughs> Came for the remaster of the first. I've heard the first one's the best one. Um, no, don't take a photo of the pot. What pot? She's lying, everyone. She's absolutely. She's trying to throw my character off. Okay, that's that's what this. That's all this is. Okay, I'm not in trouble. Moving along, uh, we're going back to fantasy land now. Uh, and those uh, fans of JRPG say we've got something for everyone tonight. We have something for everyone tonight. Uh, in final new, Blazon is fra- framing me for being a sloppy pig, but that is totally true. It's not. Uh, anyway, Tales of Arise. Uh... I am actually so excited for this. I am a, a big JRPG fan and I love the Tales series. So I am super keen for this. Anyway, the news about this is we knew it was coming. The news is that there is a a, a, a playable demo. A playable demo that you can play right now. But here's the catch. It's not on PC, which is frustrating because I saw this news. I jumped straight onto Steam and they're, they're like Bandai Namco's website to download the... the, the um, demo and it wasn't there that is because you can only play the demo on playstation and xbox which is a big bummer for us pcs so i may have to download on my playstation uh and play the demo but um the demo is available if you've got a playstation or xbox okay um can you guys stop being petty in my chat and let me get on with my game board goss anyway Demo available on PlayStation and Xbox. Stop fucking distracting me. <laughs> um, and the final, the final bit of game board goss uh, for this week, last week. Um, the most important game board goss is that you should fucking suck it up and just do it. I'm not finishing the dishes. He's probably fucking lying. I didn't leave anything in the sink. Nothing. 
Um, you can't play the D Diablo 2 demo. Why is that, Kira? Necrozza, how you doing, you legend? Uh, the most important thing of Goss is that I need to go clean the pot that I left in the sink. No, thank you. Alrighty, no, the, the final piece of Goss. I sincerely apologize to my wife for not doing the dishes and I will go and finish it now. See how I read through that really quickly? Um, are you, you're playing Monster Hunter Generations Ultimate. Uh, what about you? Well, I'm doing Game Board Goss at the moment. Uh, trying to get through Game Board Goss. But my wife is literally sabotaging my entire stream. That's better. Alrighty. <laughs> Alright, moving on. <laughs> moving along. Moving right along onto the final the final <laughs> piece of game book. I will untime her out once I've finished this. Oh fuck. <laughs> <laughs> Did you just unmod me? No, I didn't unmod you. Hello? Oh, God. Oh, God. <laughs> yeah, well, that's what you get. Now, fuck off. <laughs> sabotage my... <laughs> sabotage my Game Board Goss segment. This is so... Unprofessional. In recent news, can I stay at someone's house, please? <laughs> uh, anyway... Anyway, enough with that nonsense. I'm dead. Yeah, well... <laughs> <It killed me. laughs> Fucking untime out me now. Uh, or I will leave that... No, part. Manny's already done it. Manny's already untimed you out. Thanks. I was going to we'll wash have, your pot. Manny, we will have words about this later. I was going to wash your pot, and you know what? I'm not going to now. I'm going to leave it there for you. It doesn't even exist. It's there. I can take a fucking photo of it. I'll show you later. Okay, <laughs> sorry about that sidebar. Let's continue, shall we? Uh, there's only one final bit that I really needed to say. Reset router, end the stream. <laughs> that is marriage in a nutshell, Dougie. <laughs> that is that is it right there, okay? Um, <laughs> I'm shaking my baby seal. The bee should be many. We'll be having words about you double-crossing me on stream, my friend, okay? <laughs> Alrighty, and, and the last bit of news that I've got is uh, Struth, you bloody legends Should be plural though, okay? Plural You guys are bloody legends And the reason that I've included this Beyond the fact that you are bloody legends I did fucking... Uh, oh, well, I just timed out It's a nice... F <laughs> I can't get it into... <laughs> I can change. Oh, fuck. Well, stop being... You can't be a mod if you're going to interrupt my stream. It's not how it works. Hang on. Oh, now I have to do this on stream. What a pain. Where are you? Where are you? I could do this... There you go. She's a mod again. There we go. All right, you're a mod again. No, no, no. I did. I did it. I did the old-fashioned way. Anyway, uh, no, you're all bloody legends, and the reason I am uh, you put this in there is because um, of all the support that you guys. How is your... <laughs> exactly, Pyro. Tension seeking. Um, of all of the support you guys have been giving to people within the community who are streaming as well. Um, there are so many people who have recently joined our community who are trying to get affiliate, uh, trying to get their stats up, and I've seen so many people jumping in those uh, streams and giving all of the support, uh, which is fucking amazing. It's fucking amazing. We have such an amazing supportive community here. So, Struth, you bloody legends. Okay, Struth, you bloody legends. You're all fucking legends, and I hope you all know that. Uh, I literally spent hours making those emotes for you and looking up that other thing. Well, I'm about to start playing a Dead Space, so... Um... <laughs> anyway. 
Uh, but that is it for Game Boy Gross this week. There will be another one on Saturday, so in two streams time, because we're catching up and all that jazz. And Saturday's one is going to be a big one, guys. There is so much goss I need to tell you on Saturday. So much goss. You will actually be so shattered if you miss it. I can promise you that. Promise you that. You do not want to miss Saturday night's Game Board Goss. There is some juicy goss in there on Saturday, okay? Do not miss it. But that is it for Game Board Goss this week. So I will see you next week for Game Board Goss.